since September 2004. How depressing is that? As Kovacic brings it forward, brilliant run from him. And Ziyech is in here, and Werner smashes it over the line. They're looking for a flag, but the flag stays down, and Chelsea have the lead. And Timo Werner couldn't miss from there. A striker's dream, a yard out. On the, on the bench as well, Harvey Bale and Xavier Simmons, maybe, and Charlie Webster as well. You know, 17 and 18 year olds, so I think you know, we want to be getting them on the pitch as well. Hudson the Doy, brilliant goal! A glorious curler from Callum Hudson Adoy to double Chelsea's advantage. Placed to perfection. Got it back again, and Lukaku's there to make it three. Individual errors creeping in for Chesterfield. Lewis Hall have been dispossessed, but somehow he retrieved it and laid it on the plate for Romelu Lukaku, who makes it 3-0 with his eighth goal of the season. And even at this early stage, that's Chelsea through to round four, surely. Chance, oh, Christensen, goal! 4-0 to Chelsea. That's a rare old goal, Andreas Christensen as well. The ball looped agonisingly over Lodge and dropped into the net. They've conceded from a set play, which they'll be bitterly disappointed about. The first problem came because it was 2v1 from the short corner. Pulisic. Well, that's a risky challenge. Has to be a penalty, surely. Miller, Calvin Miller, looks at the referee, but he ran right across his path. Yeah, it's almost a, you know, sort of a, a rugby-type manoeuvre. I think he, he's losing his footing. This to make it 5-0. Oh, Loach got a hand to it. But the ball still ends up in the net. It's a fifth different scorer of the day for Chelsea. Ziyech getting his third of the season. They'll take what they can from it. Shivanga wants to get the shot away here. Good save, but it must be. It is. Asante. And that's the biggest roar of the evening. 6,000 Spyrites going absolutely potty. Two players standing over it is the in swing and delivery. It's found its way through. Well, they hardly had a kick in the early stages, but seven and a half minutes in, Plymouth Argyle lead at Chelsea. So you need one of the midfields going and joining in. the return ball, the Kaku making the near post, it's Mark as Alonso that steers it home, it's taken them 106 minutes, but the European champions finally have the lead. Well, just as I said about Werner, how that's not really having an impact on the game, well they proved me wrong for sure. Second time in 24 seasons, they've gone through but they've given it away, Aretha Barger off his line, so
Pulisic, Lukaku are in there, and Lukaku scores. Give it a start, and he's got a goal on a plate, though, by Mason Mount, and that's what the applause is for, and all a, about the assist. What a quality goal that is, from the way that Thiago Silva and Aspilicueta play out from the back. They release Mount down the right, his precision cross, and Lukaku in the right place at the right time. That's what you need to do as a centre forward, given the opportunity. He's there to side put in. Scored three or four of those howitzers for each of those clubs, as they used to be called. Just one here at, Bur at uh, Middlesbrough this season, 39 appearances for the captain. Ziyech, they've worked this well as well, it's 2 0. It's another really good move through the middle. Mount involved again in Hakim Ziyech has one heck of a left foot, and Middlesbrough have just seen it. Ben, it's a wonderful strike, but it's a slip from Lovely, it really is. I think it just deceives him. Lovely doesn't get set in terms of his footwork, and he just slides from under him, and as he as he loses his footing, the ball fizzes past him. It's an accurate shot, it's a good strike from Ziyech, but it's a mistake from the goalkeeper, and once again... Right, got the challenge in, but it's Pulisic here, and Lukaku's going to make it three. No, he's not. Sensational. I don't think he was the intended recipient of the pass. I think it was meant for Ziyech. Lukaku had to score, and he didn't. Goal line heroics. Jones wants it back, gets it back. Well, Mendy makes a save now. The cross have been a little better, I'm not sure there was room for it in Venice, but Watmore might have had a similar finish to that of Lukaku earlier, but that is more... Cup semi-final. Indeed, Chelsea are going to Wembley again. Borough have caused quite a stir in this season's FA Cup, but they've come up against a seasoned side here. Almost on his six-yard line. Move again. around the back, doesn't reach here. That's it him now, and he hits the post. Out to Mitchell. Zaha. And the flag was up. Gets it back. Jorginho. Comes by Williams, didn't play it cleanly. The feet of Verno, who's the kind of player to seize on a chance like that. 
than the young touch Martin. It was a clever ball. Another was aimed for Werner. Mitchell put in possession. Now after a costly mistake was here's Kai Havertz. towards being stable and successful. Werner. Squeeze it through for Mason Mount! Chelsea are heading for the FA Cup final for the third season in a row. Well, Mason Mount is acknowledging the pass of Timo Werner, but what a sensational first touch for Mason Mount. As he comes to him, he just takes it out of his feet, exactly what Guy Havertz didn't do on the earlier opportunity, but that first touch allowed him with his second to just side foot into the bottom corner. He does well, Timo Werner, holds the play up, plays the ball to Mason Mount, gets it back, but then just shreds it to him, that touch out of his feet, beautifully controlled. To give him the chance with the second touch, just a side foot into the bottom corner. Here's Lukaku, and here is uh, Werner, and Lukaku has hit the post, Ziyech. <laughs> Talk about wanting three or four even. <laughs> he still can't score at Wembley. He can't, and that was brilliant work from Timo Werner, just been named man of the match by the sponsors. Luk he picks up the loose ball, but then he has the awareness this time to find Lukaku. He just doesn't make the contact required. He's believing in him. Chelsea will play Liverpool in the FA Cup final of 2022. The rerun of the League Cup final from last month, and it will take place next month.